Hey there, it's Brooks here from documentsnap.com and today we're going to be talking about a technology that some but not all scanners have and that technology is called Twain. And we're going to talk about whether you need it or not and in which situations you do need it. So let's go. All right, so we have our scanner here and and we have our computer and our computer is running some sort of application and chances are in that application there'll be a big button that says scan. Now when you press that button what happen is your computer will talk to your scanner and say hey do you have any paper for me? And the scanner will say yep I sure do it'll run the paper through the it'll start the scan run the paper through the scanner and send it back to your computer to the application that asked for it which can then you know do whatever with it manipulate it store it, whatever and the technology that does this is called Twain now not all scanners support this some scanners don't and but there's ways you can usually work around that and I'm going to talk about that now so a lot of these modern document scanners like the Fujitsu ScanSnap and this Doxy and that sort of thing, they actually don't support Twain. So how does it work? Well, same as before, we have a scanner, you know, you have your computer. On your computer you have some sort of application that you want documents to go into. And what you can do is instead of pressing the scan button in the application and asking the scanner to send them a document, instead you press the scan button on the scanner and the scanner software can be configured to send that scan directly into the application. So it's kind of going the other way. The other thing you can often do is you have, you know, you have file folders on your computer of some sort. And what you can do is instead of scanning directly to an application, if that might not be possible, what you can often do is scan to a file folder and then import the file either automatically or manually from the file folder into the application. So there are options if you don't have a Twain compatible scanner and it usually work pretty much as well. So the question is do you need Twain? And it really depends on if you are using an application that absolutely requires it then of course you would need a Twain scanner to be able to scan to that application. But you, it may not be as necessary as it once was. It's just a matter of what your specific needs are. For more Going Paperless tips, head on over to documentsnap.com. Thanks.